On this episode of Small Biz 518, we're here at The Costumer in downtown Schenectady. Thank you so much for having us at The Pleasure. Costumer. It's a, it's a really honor to be here. Um, I know The Costumer has a very rich history. Can you tell us a little bit about uh, the history of your business? Yeah, so it's exciting. Over 100 years in Schenectady, uh, it started out as Anna White trading costumes for dance lessons for her daughter, which is pretty cool. So we're the fourth owners in over 100 years. Bonnie, your niche market is Scholastic Theater. Can you talk a little bit about that business? We uh, work with um, all 50 states sending out costumes across the country. So there was the previous owners, the Sheehan family, who were teachers and themselves actors, saw the need for Broadway-style costumes for Scholastic actors. We work with Schenectady, we work with Gilderland, we work with Mahonison. The list runs pretty far. Um, and the neat thing about it, too, working with local directors, is they have an opportunity to come in, we get to meet them, we help kind of um, achieve their vision. So we've actually helped them design specific costumes for their shows, which is really a great thing for us. So we've got over 150,000 costumes in our vault. Wow. How has the 518 community been integral or supportive of the customer? The 518 community has been fantastic. We're a multi-channel business, so we have our retail store, our catalog internet business, as well as theater. So being um, a brick and mortar store, it's great to be able to service that 518 community. And we work with over 20 dance schools, too, in the capital region, providing them their home base for their sort of dancewear needs working with um, people in the cosplay community, providing a nice networking opportunity for them to craft and complete their really fun cosplay costumes as well. These are not your off-the-shelf Halloween, ordinary Halloween costumes. Right. These are uh, customized costumes. Correct, Alex. So they're not your package costumes. So the nice thing about us, um, we're local here and we have designers. Um, some people have been here for over 30 years. So you have seamstress on staff that will actually adjust and alter each costume based on the size and the dimensions of the actor, is that right? That's correct, yeah. Okay. So they're very customized, which is the nice thing about our service, and it is very customer service driven. From the first interaction you're gonna have with the customer, you're gonna talk to somebody. So what can we alter, what can we wash, what's really gonna be durable and practical for those actors. And then the costume actually goes downstairs, um, and they get costumes get pulled, then they get altered to the specific dimensions of that actual actor or actress and then they're pressed, bagged, and then they're shipped out by UPS across the country. Bonnie, what are some of the notable acts or performances you've worked with over the years? We have been um, very happy to support um, shows such as Saturday Night Live. We've done uh, lots of commercials as well, some that you might be familiar with are Dilly Dilly. Dilly Dilly as in the Bud Light commercial? Exactly. You guys yeah. do Dilly Dilly? We've done some of those, yeah, wow, so that's pretty that's fun. Incredible. A neat thing that we've done recently is we work with a program called Rehabilitation Through the Arts, and we help costume their production of 1776 at Sing Sing Prison, which was really phenomenal. What do you love about the 518 community? Well, the 518 community is kind of near and dear to my heart. My husband and I both are UAlbany graduates. We met at UAlbany, so as you can imagine, 518 is special to us for you know that respect. The community itself has been hugely supportive of our business. This business has been in 518 for over 100 years. We work with so many local people here from dance schools to schools to the cosplay community. So it's so nice to have their support and feel grounded. And I think as a business with a brick and mortar store, we've had generations of families coming into the costumer. That wraps it up for this episode of Small Biz 518. For more information on the costumer, visit them in downtown Schenectady or Albany, or visit them anytime online at thecostumer.com.